Hello, hello everyone, this is Henry from Fun Game Reviews coming to you for more awesome round of base reviews. Alright guys, we are doing this for Mr. Shanu, also known as Fox Traz. So let's go ahead and take a peek at his account. He has some insane amount of jewels, but he has asked me to respect it and do not touch uh, those jewels. So I am respecting his request and not touching it. So let's go take a look here. All right. I mean, what I will start off with at least is to claim uh, whatever is available to me. So that, you know, this helps with uh, the setup here. He used all his attacks so far. Ooh, but that doesn't look so good. All right, so let's make sure that everything is being claimed. Uh, let's go ahead and auto clear so that when he logs in, at least, you know, everything is already as expected. So, ooh, something we can do for him here is uh, set up his account with his top highest level guys to try to get him the maximum amount of gold he can get so let's do that uh, let's see unless he actually you know farms otherwise we'll see alright so just to very much start off he has a lot of resources 3.5 million souls 30k rings whoa very freaking nice uh, let's kind of see what he has set up though. 13 skill, 15 skill. Oh wait, does he have... I mean, I saw he had shards too. So let's go and evolve them. He has no shards there. He has some shards here. So we might as well uh, get those uh, risen up just a tiny bit here. So let's go ahead and do that. But before we do that, let's kind of look at what he has in store. He has a great sage. He has he has a hefty amount of heroes here. I would probably get rid of that uh, Pyro Pete, though. That Pyro Pete is not going to help in any way, shape, or form. So let's do that. Evolution. Oh, man. 12,000. That's too expensive. But yeah, he has enough to do a couple here. So let's do that. Evolution 8. Not a big difference. Alright. So let's go ahead and use up all the resources with as many as he could. Good thing I he didn't have that. So anyway, uh, I almost messed that one up and clicked the button. He, but he didn't have the resources to do the upgrade anyway. So no worries I didn't fully mess that up all right so Chiron 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 uh, he only has 10 there so let's kind of go see what he has before I start clicking through everything he has a lot of great stage a lot of abyss demon toxic shaman and rainy then let's probably go check those out I'm probably gonna do this and uh, no not that one probably go see what he has Let's go set those up uh, to start. Probably spell edge wise. He has 1.2 million resources. Holy smokes. What kind of account is this? He has so much resources. It's not even, it's not even funny. Holy moly. Mr. Shanu, you have such an amazing account. I don't know why you haven't, uh, you know, used this to your maximum potential here. You could definitely do your maximum potential using what you got here. Uh, and then for here, you're also missing out putting, you're not using all your heroes to basically get those levels. So, or maybe you're doing that because you can actually solo. I don't really know. I really don't know. Uh, Actually, let me uncheck these. I, I think what you're doing here is you're purposely doing this so that uh, like your your little heroes can be farmed up, I'm guessing. So I kind of unchecked them. I don't really know what you were doing with that. So I'm going to leave that alone and not touch that. Um, 
but let's see hero hall six six five six and uh five okay at least you're getting to level fives so that's pretty good um oh well, you have no speed scrolls so i don't want to i don't want to use something that you didn't want me to use so let's go and try and kind of check what you have here okay it was pretty nice you started this setup and you basically gave me a lot of resources to kind of go off of so here we go you had a lot of research like you have a ridiculous amount of resources for me to use uh, for this that's actually pretty awesome I'm I'm pretty stoked that you you're able to do this pretty awesome all right so the next one here is abyss demon we're gonna give abyss demon a big boost here a big boost just because he has the proper resources to do so we're gonna give that abyss demon a good proper setup here we he wants me to improve his account as much as possible and give him the like the potential best of the best setup he can possibly do look at his resources i really love the amount he has waiting for me it is crazy all right so let's go ahead and uh abuse what he has a little bit uh but yes this is his current setup he has it so that he has toxic shaman i mean not toxic shaman pangoli and a few others so I think what you need to continue focusing on is getting your hero halls up as much as possible do not slow down on that like you're doing just fine you should not be slowing down on that so this is how your team is currently set up I think I can do a little bit better to China change you up to make you a better player here so let's go take a look all right so what do you have left great stage so great stage should be getting like a bunch of love here you have all kinds of resources for great sage essences wise at least so let's go use those up get him his get him it right away there you go you got your divine you got a couple levels free levels in there so uh, let's go see what you got cap there cap there he is also capped this is also this is close to cap that one's capped that one okay these are all pretty well capped out it doesn't require too much okay 125 there 125 there 130 120 120 wow this guy has a lot of resources a lot of levels he should be powering these up more but let's see okay so level five there level four there we're gonna put that to five i'm just gonna upgrade his pangolis just a tiny bit he has he has the resources to do so so it's nothing to worry about nothing to worry about all right oh that's level one though that's level seven at least that's level one so yeah we're probably gonna need to change up a lot of things here but he is doing a just well look at that okay 130 on that we're gonna probably pin one in here so he can gain those levels um, let's kind of see a lot of his heroes are kind of overly capped here so so let's kind of see what he wants and what we want to do with this so we're gonna take away these heroes we're gonna change this up just a tiny bit here we're gonna leave that there we're gonna leave that there we're gonna leave we can probably leave him but we want to take him out there's no reason for that i know you're doing that specifically because of defense uh but i would prefer i would prefer to probably change that i mean actually since it's defense that's fine you can leave that there uh, but i'm gonna take out all the hero aids i'm gonna take out all hero aids we're gonna we're gonna do a shift here we're going to try and make all of your guys as efficient as possible. Um, so let's go see. Uh, you, ha I mean, you have the heroes and everything. So we're going to try to make this as efficient as possible. So here you go. Okay, so you have 
this guy in there, which is not supposed to be in here. Okay. All right. So this is what you have. I'm going to put in, uh, in replacement of that, I'm going to put in, uh, let's see what you have. You don't have a toxic Shamia. You have some wraths though. I thought I was supposed to, hold on. So that's empty, that's empty, that's not empty, no wonder. Okay, I was like, I swear you had an Abyss Demon. I swear you had an Abyss Demon. All right, so Abyss Demon, we're going to put Abyss Demon here. Weapons-wise, you also have the equipped a little bit wrong here. We were going to try to change that. We're going to change that around. So let's go give, let's go see. All right, so this guy, we're going to go change his weapon up. Uh, let's try to give him the best the best one here and then for her okay that's fine that's also fine that's also fine so for him we're gonna change his weapon to uh, to this one wait hold on this is for executioners does what does he have I don't remember oh yeah he actually has executioners so that would have been a perfect weapon that is exactly the perfect weapon for him. So we're going to put that weapon on him. Okay. So we're going to start off with this guy right here. We're going to go and see what can we do to maximize and his potential. We're going to maximize his potential here. So give him as much damage as possible. We need speed though. Speed is definitely important. And then... What I'm going to do is I'm going to put in uh, one of the Pangolis. Oh, I forgot you only have two. So you actually cannot do that. You have to do this. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do that. I'm going to put in uh, this. I'm going to put in a Pangoli in place of that. I mean, there's not really too much choice. Uh, but yeah. Okay. So we're going to change out the equipments here. We're going to make it so that these weapons are fully intact for him instead uh, this pangoli also oh no this is the one I just gave it to change this equipment so let's make sure that this one has both weapons perfectly great uh, another one you want to make sure that survives is actually you know what since you have this guy we're gonna change this guy out you don't need to have him there uh, we're gonna change it like this to try to maximize here. We're trying to maximize as much as possible. So let's see. All right, so that looks fine now. What we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna change these around specifically. So let's go see. So this guy, we're gonna give him uh, this, this guy and a Pangoli specifically so that he has a lot of HP, he has the damage reduction, and he can survive and live and be annoying. Okay, and then for this Ambrosia, we're about damage here. We're all about damage here, so let's go do that. She probably could use a dodge, uh, or let's see what she has here. Oh, these are like all low level. All low level. Yeah, all these don't have any rings or anything attached to it, so they're not going to be that useful. Um, I mean, this is probably the, the best bet. Okay, you're going to try to shoot from as far as possible and <coughs> and accomplish, like, way, way, way much more. All right, let's see. Uh let me see let me see okay so we're gonna feed these guys to this guy it's pretty nice you have the you have eggs and everything so I'm kind of thinking yeah so I'm gonna get rid of this guy and feed him to this guy or maybe not hold on which one needs the exp more is what I'm gonna go look at uh, like maybe this guy would probably be better but but no all right, let's see, let's see, let's see. This one's already capped. Like, everything is pretty much capped out. That's the nice part of what you did for me. At least you have it, so everything's pretty much capped. You have a lot of experience in each one, so it definitely can bring you pretty far. Definitely can bring you pretty far. Hmm. 
Great Sage is great too, but I think this guy will definitely need the level. So we're going to feed him uh, Pyro Pete. You have tons more of yeah, EXP stuff. They're like 120s. So, I mean, yeah. Ooh, you have... How many blockheads do you have? Oh, you actually have two blockheads too. That's actually really nice. Really, really nice. All right. You got Pounder. You're kind of investing in him too. He's not that amazing though. So what we're going to do is we're going to try to get this guy up a little bit more. We're going to try to get him to, let's see, 13. Gets to the next one. I mean, we want to try to get him as great as possible. So, you know, let's see. Let us see. Let us see. Okay, I think let's continue giving it to him. Get him to 15. I mean, 17. You can definitely do that, too. Let's do that. We get him to at least 17. That looks perfect. This way, you will conduct a lot of damage, a lot of heals. It will be awesome. It will be awesome. Without a doubt. So, I know that was a little expensive, but we got to do this. We got to do this to make you uh, like a better... A lot better so let's continue here uh, let me see let me see man your base is like way better than mine when it comes to walling it up and using getting these upgraded you're doing a great job on that man a great great job uh, all right let's see another thing is uh, so that's all good here. That is all good here too. You have the defenses. You have the offense here. The offensive team is here. Actually, before I do that, I want to, I want to, I really want to invest into that blockhead though. That blockhead will give so much. Uh, I mean, right now you're at 17. That should be more than enough. Uh, I'd almost invest uh, some in here. So yeah, you want to you want to get him max too. But I wanted to give a little bit of speed into him just cuz you didn't have so. So let's see. Also, uh the wizard teams are probably the strongest. I would probably just max these out uh as much as possible. I'm going to get this to get this a little higher so that you can at least have 40 wizard damage is very nice damage so don't get me wrong it is awesome Ooh, you have a lot to go by man you have a lot to go by so here enchant in for enchant here we're gonna go all into attack rate we're gonna max this out max this to 20 oh you have no more enchant crystals so yeah I mean you're kind of you're kind of investing in everything that's kind of crazy you're, you're a little everywhere you shouldn't be doing that you should be focusing on your main guys all right your main guys are right here let's kind of see what you got also I want to see your shards your fusion okay so you got you got a lot of pangolis uh, we got that Ooh, you got a decent you got a decent amount of shards looking good looking good uh, you got a lot of DGNE. You got some uh, Skull Mage. That's pretty awesome. Uh, these Blitz Bombers can probably be fed. This can probably be fed. But yeah, that's pretty good what you got going which for you. Uh, I almost wonder if I should just put all the glory into this guy. I want him to have six and then you can feed one of those eggs. Like truthfully, if you have this, you can you can probably solo at your level 87. You can definitely solo some stuff. Like, let's see, can he do it though? Mercenaries, he don't have any mercenary levels in there, uh, but you should have mercenary levels specifically so you can continue upgrading. Okay, you ran out of rings, but you are also below level. You also need glory. So let's kind of see what you can, what you have going for you. Mm, that's level seven. That's not bad. This gray sage though definitely needs work as well. But 
yeah I think because you have a great stage that still needs work I'm gonna switch this back I'm gonna switch him back but once you have your great stage actually up and a lot better we're gonna we're gonna make sure you have more fun with that but as of right now you don't have uh, your great sage doing too much so we're gonna leave him as at that I would like if you want me to come back in here I would definitely say use all your eggs I mean you can do this yourself instead of me doing it because I don't I don't feel comfortable sometimes using people's eggs because maybe that you wanted to put them somewhere else like say wrath or something like that I mean that's totally up to you that's totally up to you but I am saying upgrade your abyss demon to as awesome as you can so that you can get him like you can make it so that he can solo for your whole team your entire team okay so yes uh, let's see another thing is I'm gonna use all these uh, tokens we're gonna we're gonna go and uh, make it possible let's go see buy for gold all right all right so I'm gonna go buy these enchant crystals up we're gonna go continue the upgrading your abyss demon we're gonna go do that and make him amazing let's go so let's continue to do the enchants for him get that maxed out all right that's maxed out the next one I would say to do is increase attack here and so definitely you're gonna want to do that and then you go in increase hit rate uh, or you can actually do damage reduction it, it's your up to you It's your choice I'd probably go damage reduction actually and then at increase attack rate increase damage so focus all your stuff okay all of it don't don't invest in anything else here you like just don't need to right now it's too early of a stage for you you're not gonna earn too much to to kinda do that so let's see okay so I got all that I need I still need to change these two guys up real quick so let's see what you got left over um, let's see let's see uh, we want to go for attack okay so attack that will give HP and also more attack Oh, but that's only level two. There's level four there. Six there, one there, one, 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 one. Okay, so you're definitely lacking some some rings here, but this is probably your best best choice after that. You want to crit when you do a big explosive damage, and then for this one, uh, I would say attack here, and then. I see that's level six I mean that doesn't benefit her though and then this one has uh, kind of weak monkeys that get spawned but everything else is only level one so that's kind of all you can do so here you go this is your new setup okay this is how I set it up for you this is your probably your best new setup you can possibly have for your current team um, and also I just wanted to thank you for letting me jump in on this base review for you and trying to expand you as much as possible everything else looks pretty good and golden I'm trying not to use any of your other resources like I'm leaving your eggs and and stuff like that but I would totally recommend that you continue upgrading your abyss demon uh, and then once your abyss demon is pretty much done or if you're okay with having it settle at 17 for now because the next one's at 19 and then the last one is at 20 I would probably say go ahead and proceed in uh, doing some of the others for a little bit actually you know what I could do here I can probably even do this make this a little better too this only needs up to 20 2 and then that's 22 you can just upgrade that directly boom all right so get got you an extra five levels there very awesome oh 
let's go and let's go test this puppy out actually since you have that we're gonna test this puppy out you have 55,000 let's see how he does let's see let's see all of your guys have practically have divines it's quite awesome your heroes too it's actually really nice cuz look at that boom your heroes are awesome my friend awesome 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 all right big fat heels big heels are required here come on big heels big heels Oh, big heels, big heels, big heels, big heels. Here we go. Uh, all right, so one died, but look at this. We're still going, and you're still winning, and your heels are still going. Oh, why did it stop? Oh, if I continued that base there, I probably would have done a lot better. Uh, but the base did not go down. Oh, that was my bad. Sorry. All right. Probably should have tried a different one, but it's okay. This is your current uh, settings. I I know I wanted to switch him out though, but the only thing is uh, that's being used for defense. So maybe what we'll do is we'll we'll change this up so that you'll also have your offensive team. Your offense and offensive team will be probably better. So let's go ahead and remove all this. So we can definitely just go like this and reference. All right. So let's go do this. We're going to remove all the hero aids. We're going to optimize this as much as possible. Oh, I don't know why you would have a blockhead on landslide. Landslide does not need blockhead. The blockhead is not meant for for tanks. It's for DPS only. All right. Here we go. All right. So we're going to actually change these guys out. It will be a lot better if we change them like this. It probably would be more optimized as much as we would like to say. So let's go see. I'm going to put the strongest Pangoli there. And then I'm going to put this guy in here. So damage wise, this guy should probably be doing the most damage here. Okay. Uh, and then... Actually, I want to get rid of that guy too. And then probably put in Ambrosia. So Ambrosia can be the next awesome, the most awesome one. So let's see. Get HP in that. 3, 3. Okay, so there's a Pangolian there. Uh, damage dealers, damage dealers, damage dealers. Okay, let's see. Let me see, let me see. Uh, so damage dealers, damage dealers. Let me see. How do I put this for damage dealers? Uh, this one will probably use... We can go with... Oh, but that one's too low. So there's that damage dealer, and then there's that damage dealer. Uh, we gotta switch positions, though. We're gonna switch positions so that it maximizes on more damage. Okay. Let's kind of see here. Mm. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, another thing is we gotta assign weapons. We gotta assign weapons. I almost forgot about the weapons. They are just as important. The weapons are just as important. So I was actually using the defense team uh, to attack. That was probably the wrong choice. I should have been using my offensive team. So let's go do that. This is your offensive team. I set up your defensive already, so yeah, it's definitely needed for your offensive team. So this guy probably needs to survive. Or maybe, you know what, I'll make her survive. Hmm, okay. We'll make her survive a little bit more. This is attack percent 10. 10, this is percent wise is probably better. So we're going to go for percent wise. I mean... The damage kind of gets reduced just a tiny bit, but it's not that much. It's not going to make a big difference. So let's go see. For her, it's that. Okay, and then this one is also Dark Rider. I'm trying to give him a little bit more HP. 
I'm just doing a little bit of referencing here just to see what is available to me. All right, so the last one. So you have three pangolis for that. So that was actually pretty cool. So the very last one, uh, we're going to have to, we need to do damage. So we need to do damage. Hmm. Mm, I mean, okay, that's level four, that's level six. But the thing is, the pounder is kind of pointless. I mean, level six, you're only, you don't, there's no boost. I mean, the only thing you're going to get out of a boost here is probably the, the levels, uh, other than that. But I mean, at the same time, the only thing you have is purely like that. So, I mean, even this one is better because it at least, I mean, you're not just using the levels. This at least spawns some little little things even though it's not that great it still helps okay that one's one percent that one's two percent um that one's one okay so i mean the only other best thing you can probably do is that so there is your team for lord's league a uh, defense wise and offense wise all right uh let me go triple check what else you wanted on your account so i wanted to see so i got you pretty good uh I see you're asking to do a 10x hire, but you're going to do the 10x hire during another spend event, not this one. So I'm not going to spend any of your jewels whatsoever. Um, so another thing is we're probably going to we're probably going to want to copy this. So let's see your guild boss one. Okay, I see your guild boss. You're, you're trying to use this, but you're only at oh you are level 10 there, so that's not too bad. Um, let me see your guild boss will probably do a lot more okay I'm gonna just change all of this out uh, well not everything not everything all right so what we're gonna do put in uh, mr. okay we gotta t we gotta take some of these out so we're gonna change this out just a tiny bit we're gonna take out all of these little hero because uh, yeah oops wrong one that one and that one yeah we need we need to try to expand on this so let's see truthfully I would probably want to say the team you're using uh, for your attack is probably better than her cuz I mean your divine your divines like whatever so let's see I mean it's only level one divine so let's go check the guild boss real quick uh setup okay she has level one divine she has at least this she needs one more skill up but she doesn't have it uh but you have divine so you're fine let's see okay well, that doesn't really matter okay so we're gonna go back here let's go take a look we're gonna try to put in we're gonna put in this guy here we're gonna put in like normal we're gonna do that one for here and then that one for here so that you maximize damage and get some speed in that one doesn't change this one you can probably put in like a berserker later so that you basically make him survive longer okay uh, for this one you're, you're doing damage, so let's go do damage. So uh, I think this is good. For this guy, though, we're going to do this guy. And pro I mean, this guy is not that great. So no. So you have to have the, the two tanks. For guild bosses, the two tanks have to be able to survive because they're right in the face of the guild boss. Okay, These three are from the outsides, so you can shoot him from a distance it's probably the more optimal thing to do here uh, one percent crit and then this one is ten percent damage but you want her to live too so I'm gonna just put her there and these are the ones that you want living because they hit the hardest okay so here we're gonna do that and then this one we're probably gonna do I mean, these are all level ones, right? Yeah. So, what for this one? Did I just choose that one without? Uh, I think this one will probably be the most optimal. I'm thinking this is probably the most optimal. Uh, let me see. Let me see. 
attack there, HP there, but HP, you can recover. Uh, I mean, recovering HP is not that important in a guild boss because, I mean, he can technically block it. So it's not that good. Not that good. So let me sit on that one for a minute. Let me sit on that one for a minute and kind of contemplate how, how to do this best, okay? How do I do this best? Uh, yeah. Hmm. This one is all about survivability. I think maybe you put these two in there, but you definitely need to upgrade more. You definitely need to upgrade more, without a doubt. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna switch these actually so she can maximize out more on more damage. So that is your guild boss setup, okay? Your arena and battle royale, I would say if you like it, steal what I have set up for your offensive for arena and battle royale. Other than that, I think that's pretty much it for this review. Uh, I've given you everything. Now let's go and test this once more. This is the offensive team this time instead of the defensive team, okay? Okay, this one's obviously stronger than you by a big long fold, so we got to ditch that one. But this one is more doable, so let's go ahead and do this one. Here we go. We're going to blow this one up. We're going to try to make sure the heals are still there. Ooh, look at that explosion from him. So awesome. All right, here we go. This is what I like to see. This is what I like to see. All right, so we just blow everything up. That was an immediate win there. That was an awesome immediate win. Just like that. All right, we're going to try this again. I guess that was a bot base, so let's try another one. Uh, that one looks too easy. We're going to go for a little, we're going to try a little harder ones. Okay, so this one looks decent. This one looks decent. So what we're going to do, let's go bring them in. Let's go bring them in, explode, get that damage in. What we're going to do is we need that damage reduction immediately. He is dying there. So let's go. Let us go. Let us go. Ooh, get the heals in. Get those heals in. We need those heals. We need those heals. Oh. All right. Let those. So the two tanks are practically down now. We are trying to heal it up. They are annoying because they have a toxic shaman and making it hard because you can't really heal that much. But I mean, you at least got one star out of this. So it's not too bad. Not too bad. So I'll just quit this now. Um. But yeah, that's pretty much it for me. Uh, I mean, you just have to continue improving. I think for me, the only thing I would ask you to do is try to get your Abyss Demon to 20 out of 25 and then get this a block hit to 20 out of uh, 25. And you're pretty much golden to have a solo farmer to start with, okay? Other than that, uh, I'm seeing, what else can you have? Do you have a rainy then? I think I said no already. You don't have a rainy then. Maybe there's some little bits of stuff that is capable of upgrades. Yeah, you definitely can upgrade this guy. I would say upgrade him with what you got and give it to him. There you go. So you can level him up a little bit more too. Uh, but yeah, let's continue this. All right, there. Abyss Demon is now level 134, almost 135, so that's looking on the plus side. But yeah, definitely if you open up all five of these and then you put a, put one of this into your Abyss Demon, ooh, he's going to be awesome. He is going to be awesome. Okay? That is technically what I would recommend, but I don't know how you would like to use your glory eggs. So I kind of want to stay away from using them for you, just in case you wanted to do it differently, okay? But yeah, uh, I would almost, I'd almost even probably, because I see this, you, you should probably fuse two more uh, of these pangolis, just so you can have five pangolis in total. Those pangolis will help you a lot, a lot, a lot. Uh, from preventing yourself from death okay you want to have at least one pangoli in every single slot here this way you can survive m to its maximum potential 
as of right now you're putting in some stuff that doesn't really help you too much like this one and this one like that's why your your wonton just died instead of having that extra bit of life he died so having that extra bit of life will definitely make a big difference for you okay uh, other than that that's pretty much it I I'm gonna put this back onto auto raid for you uh, let's kind of see this probably will give more 28 29 okay that's probably better still 20 nine hmm okay and then let's let's kind of see oh this one gives more than landslide this one gives more than landslide I'm just kind of mix and matching here but I mean it's not a big difference oh that one that one's worse than landslide so let's kind of see oh that one's definitely worse than landslide so we're just gonna do it like that give him 10 hours that's probably the perfect matchup for your 10 hours of uh, auto auto rating here. All right, and that's pretty much it, buddy. That is all I have for you. I hope you enjoy Shanu, and uh, this is Henry from Fun Game Reviews. Please like, subscribe, and share. And I'm pretty much done with the review. Hope you enjoyed. Have an awesome one.